Hello everyone and welcome to this tutorial. In this video, we'll walk you through how to set up your VO cam for recording to get the best video quality. These steps apply whether you're using the VO cam 2 or VO cam 3. We'll go through everything you need to prepare before recording, how to position your camera and tips for recording multiple games. Before you begin, make sure your camera is fully charged. A full charge takes about 4 hours and this will help avoid interruptions during your recording. Next, check that you have installed the VO Camera app on your phone or tablet. You can find the app in the App Store or Google Play. Once it's installed, log in to your VO account. Now connect to your VO Cam using the app. In the Settings page, check if there's enough storage space available. If your camera is running low on space, delete older recordings to make room for new ones. Also, Take a moment to clean the camera lenses. Use a soft cloth to wipe away any dust or smudges. This helps maintain clear and sharp video quality. Make sure the pitch or field is ready for recording. The lines should be clearly marked and visible. It's important that all four corners of the field are in the camera's view. This ensures the AI tracking can follow the action correctly. Also, check the lighting. Natural daylight is ideal. But if you're recording indoors or at night, make sure the field is well lit with artificial lights. Avoid unnecessary movement around the pitch. Too many players or extra balls before the game can confuse the AI system. Now it's time to set up your camera. Start by placing your tripod 3 to 5 meters from the sideline, aligned with the center line. If you are outdoors, try to set up with the sun or lights behind the camera. This prevents glare or shadows in your footage. Mount the VO cam securely to the tripod. If you're using VO cam 3, push in the small handle after mounting to lock it tightly. Turn on the camera and extend the tripod to its maximum height. This gives the best possible view of the entire pitch. Then connect to the camera through the app and check the camera preview. Make sure all four corners of the field are visible. If not, Adjust the tripod or camera position until it's correctly aligned with the center line. When everything is set, press the record button in the app. The camera will start capturing the game. It's important not to move the camera or tripod after recording has started. Moving it can cause tracking problems and affect the results from features like VO Analytics and Player Spotlight. If you're recording more than one game in a row, remember to stop the recording after each match. Do not combine games into a single recording. Recordings longer than 8 hours may not be supported. Also, combining games can affect the AI's ability to create highlights and assign teams correctly. For each new game, stop the current recording and start a new one. This keeps each match organized and ensures better performance from the camera's smart features.